Hello everybody and welcome back to the most irrelevant channel here on YouTube today and welcome to the final episode of my stick or twist challenge here on Football Manager 2018. Now guys, I just want to start by saying a massive huge thank you to everyone who's taken part in this, especially to those guys who've just continued through to the end and stuck with the whole series. It's been so fun to do and yeah, I'm, I'm really thinking about doing a, a similar style thing, uh, which I might just do before the end of 2015, but um, yeah, it's been great fun and uh, just want to thank you guys for for sticking along for the ride, it's been really, really enjoyable. Um, but obviously, you guys have come here to see how your players have done in the last ever episode of Stick or Twist. So let's get into it, shall we? I don't get what I want, I get what I need Every single day I'm heading off to my dream And I get everything that I damn well please I don't give a damn if you are listening to me Cause I run it, I'm the only one that really want it I'm the only one that's really got it I'm just being honest, I'm just doing everything I promise Cause I want it bad enough that I'ma make it as an artist And I know I'm not the smartest and I know I'm not the largest But I promise you that I'ma be the one that worked the hardest Cause I promise you that I'm just getting started And I promise you that my skills are getting sharper So I'ma get charted, can't be guarded Nah, I'm the one to get retarded Get the party started, yeah, get the party started Yeah, so let me get up on it, yeah Bitch, you got me fucked up, I don't know what's up pour that shit in my cup we about to turn up crank this shit up so loud sounds like we're sold out in front of a whole That's crowd we just yeah. control now don't take this shit too personally everybody got a different version of me everybody gotta be learning from me everybody wanna be working with me and i feel like there's uncertainty and urgency to find out what you wanna be but honestly we change our minds constantly so stop and breathe and find out who you wanna be So I'd be cautious I hope that you're watching Don't try to stop this Work until I'm nauseous Cause I will not quit No, because I want this Don't try to stop me Failure ain't an option So I'd be cautious I hope that you're watching Don't try to stop this Work until I'm nauseous Cause I will not quit No, because I want this Don't try to stop me Now Well, there we have how your players have done it on screen. Now you should be able to see how they've done in season 15. As you see, we've had some really, really solid performances as well, as well as some bad ones. Obviously, Robbie Campbell down there with Solanke this time round, zero points. Conor Rondon with Mbappe, three points. And Leslie Joy with Timo Warner with only five points. Just outside the relegation zone, we've got Liam P202 with Clive Oak with just 13 points. Uh, Hyper Croc and Hyper Wars, um, you know, 18 and 20 respectively. Adam Palmer then with 32 points is going to be enough for him to kind of get anywhere decent in the league system. Uh, we've then also got ahead of that, we've got Mr Z with uh, Demata, 45 points, not too bad. NSK with uh, Chris North, 47 points. And D underscore 10 HD with Suguri with 48 points. In that kind of Europa League spot, we've then got Liam the God Plays Gaming, who was top going into last week, having not the best weeks, with only 51 points. Could this mean that somebody has taken the top spot from him? Obviously, we'll see very, very shortly. Above him, we've got Chelsea FC with Djokovic, uh, with 52, uh, yeah, 52 points. Then got Nerd Benji with Peter, um, and a decent performance to fair from him with 67 points. We've then got the three big boys sitting at the top. We've got Tom Williams coming out of nowhere. And as I said, he really just contributed a little bit earlier on in the series than who knows what could have been. Uh, finishing on 89 points. Joint with that is where well, you can see who it is. With he swatched players to McLeod. I think that's how you pronounce it. And he has got 89 points. Could he have taken the top spot? It was close before for him and Liam the God plays gaming but can he take it the top spot off him and then we've got in top spot with the best score in the whole series it's James Logan with Satch with 120 points but guys it is now time to see the final table of the stick or twist challenge here on Football Manager Mobile 2018 are you ready I'm ready let's go 
Right, the table, overall final table of the Stick or Two Challenge. I'm going to be starting out going from the bottom all the way to the top, and obviously building suspense as we go. As you can see, Connor Rodden sitting at the bottom there, 302 points just ahead of him. Robbie Campbell didn't score any points this time around, but luckily he just managed to, you know, finish above him, uh, even though they're still in the relegation zone. But they've got Liam P02, 323 points overall for him. Uh, Hyper Croc then with 394. Above that, we then go to Adam Palmer. Uh, he obviously joined in a season late as well, so a pretty good attempt for him on 454. Above that, we've got Tom Williams, uh, 473. If only Tom would have been a little bit more active towards the kind of middle uh, few seasons, who knows what could have happened there. Uh, above Tom Williams, we've got Mr. Z there uh, with 484. Above that, we've got Nerd Benji, 569. Very respectable score indeed. Uh, then we've got... Uh, where are we? Sorry, no badgie. We've then got uh, Leslie Joy above that, 584. NSK then with 616 points for him. We then move into the big boys at the top. Hyper Wars with 661 points in that first Europa League spot. We've then got D underscore 10 HD finish on, on 677. We then move in to the top four. In fourth place, we have Chelsea FC. A very solid performance, very consistent throughout the whole save, finishing on 734 points. In third place, we have James Logan with 700 and 97 points a very valiant effort especially towards the end he started gaining a lot of points and did you know put some really really solid numbers especially this week with that 120 score and at the time everyone has been waiting for the top two it was close at the end of season 14 with just the 39 points in it so has the manager who does not want to be named done enough to knock Liam, the God Plays Gaming, off the top spot. No, he hasn't. He finished in second place with 861, with Liam, the God Plays Gaming, finishing in first place with just 862 points, means he wins by just one goal. One goal, boys and girls. Just one goal. Well, there we have it. What an exciting end to what has been one of my favourite series to pretty much record and edit all that kind of good stuff. I hope you guys have enjoyed it as well, because I surely have. And as I said, I've got something in mind that I might be starting. Thank you to Chelsea FC for the idea. I might work on kind of what you sent me. Uh, but anyway, guys, if you have enjoyed this episode and the whole series, then don't forget to show your support by dropping a like on the video. I have been Just Mike Plays, and I'll speak to you later soon. This is just Mike plays. Yeah. Y'all better listen to what just Mike says. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is just Mike plays. Yeah. Y'all better listen to what just Mike yeah. says. Yeah, this is yeah. just Michael plays. He be on that football manager. He plays it for days, but he still is like an amateur. He's stuck in his ways. He'll never finish a series. Listening to what he says, then do the opposite clearly.